Good afternoon guys, firstly I hope you're all well and of course welcome back to my channel. Now as we can tell from the title, welcome back to a Gymshark haul. This launch is coming on the 31st of August. First things first, I obviously have a discount code GLJ so this will save you 10% of any item on the Gymshark website. If you do use it, please do send me a screenshot via an email or DM on Instagram. So I can say a huge thank you um, obviously for supporting me with this launch. I'm in a fat loss phase, I'm two kilos down so my sizes are changing changing to a degree. Um, I'm at 34B up top and I'm also, um, my glutes are around 42 inches. My waist is around 31 to 30 and a half, 30 and a half to 31 inches. I can't remember the exact number. In this video, I'm going to run through everything. My sizing, the material, if I actually like the item, if I don't like the item. I've gone through and picked different varieties of items, ones I've not tried before, new ones. Guys, some of these items are insane. I've got to get through all of this. We have a lot of items. There's a lot of items here, guys. So let's get into the video. And of course, please don't forget the like button, subscribe. If you have any questions regarding any of the items, please do DM me on Instagram or comment down below. Um, and I, of course, will get back to you as quickly as I can. So happy shopping and let's get kind of straight into the haul. Firstly, we are starting with the Legacy collection. I've actually got quite a lot of these items. So first item that I'm going to actually show you is the Legacy T Bra Sports Bra, which is actually a medium support. Now I have this in the black. Guys, this bra is stunning. Honestly, you should see a couple of these. There's two bras in this haul. Wow. Wow. I actually think these are going to be like best sellers 110%. And I haven't worn anything that has mesh like on an item of clothing in a very, very long time. There we go, and of course you've got the cute, really, really nice Gymshark logo there. And you can actually see all of the mesh. There is no padding here whatsoever. However, there's material obviously in front of the actual mesh. So you can see the meshes there and you've then got material there to make sure you cannot see anything. So nothing is visible at all. In terms of the back as well, it's literally one strap. It is an adjustable, this strap is adjustable. Personally, just stay true to size. I always stay true to size with the Gymshark sports bras. I always stick for a small up top, to be honest with you. I just prefer that fit. The other colours also look stunning. The actual raspberry pink looks insane. I was going to get myself the dust green, however, I've got a lot of green in this haul and you'll see it. So I was like, right, no, stick to my black sports bra. Um, it's also coming white, which I've actually kind of not wearing white as much now because I make it so dirty. So now I've kind of gone for black, which I just love it. This is such a bit of me. If you obviously have seen a couple of my previous hauls or anything, if you follow me for a period of time, you will know anything with a small strap and that's very small, you could say at the front because I don't have much to cover. I'm there for it. I'm, I'm there for anything that is very, very small. This is insane. Then we move on to the Legacy oversized sweatshirt. I got this because I thought, you know what, let's try something different. I won't lie to you guys, it's a lot more, it's a lot boxier than I thought it would be. I don't know if that's kind of the correct wording. I've actually gone for a medium here and it does look quite big, um, as we can see here. <laughs> it's stretching backwards. It does look quite big. I love the colour and um, that's also the reason why I got it because I just love anything neutrals, like browns. I'm very much in my browns era, at browns and blacks. This honestly feels like I've got like a rugby, you know, like a rugby polo neck on. Is it a polo neck? Yeah, you know what guys are, I don't mean. Um, <laughs> it feels like that, like it feels like a boy's rugby top that's very, very heavy. The only thing I'm not sure of is actually the fit at the top here with the actual neckline. Like I'm not sure if I'll sue this. We'll see obviously in the video. I'll, I'll tell you guys the truth, what I think. Um, yeah, I'm surprised. <laughs> I'm actually surprised. This fits honestly like a dream. Like it fits really nice. I could probably tuck this in actually to my bra, like and have it a little bit more cropped. Um, than that, to be fair. So it can show a little bit more bum, but yeah. I rate it, like the arm length as well is nice. As you can see here, like it fits nicely on the arms. It's quite a nice, not like too tight. It's quite a nice baggy. It does come under like this. You have got this part, but I personally always tuck that under. Um, so there we have it. And I love, I love this logo. Like that there, I think it's really, really nice. It does feel, I feel like you can see it like there. When I just do that, you can see that it's quite stiff. I do quite like it though. So yeah. I do actually, I rate this. I'm surprised. <laughs> Next up, we have the Legacy Logo Leggings. This is not something that I usually rush for. The reason being is because I love my seamless. I am very much a seamless person. I'm not usually this material. This material reminds me of like Lululemon. And I do find with this kind of material, it's very much camel toe. Um, and it's just not, it's not usually a bit of me. Because there's no front seam, which I'm, I'm rating like, if there's a front seam, it's camel toe central in my opinion. But because there is no front seam, and I was like, oh, do you know what? They've got the scrunch bum. This could look very, very flattering, which is why I've actually got these. Again, you'll see them, like, they are so stretchy, guys. So stretchy. The material is insane. It's so buttery and so soft. The actual logo is rubber. Um, 
you can say it's like a rubbery, 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 rubbery fill on the actual leg in that, as we can see. I love the colour and I just thought, do you know what? That's a bit different. And yeah, I, I think they're really nice. Okay, so I believe I said these are scrunched. I'm actually incorrect. The legacy leggings are not scrunched. It was just the way the leggings were actually sat. What I will say to you is they are definitely a, a bigger fit. They already, there is quite a lot of material already around the actual bum I have found. That's Lola coming up the stairs, my dog. <laughs> to show you guys what I'm meaning, can we see like here, like there feels like a lot of material like around here. Like they fit really nicely, but as we can see, like they're not that tight. And as we can see, I can't really pull them up how I like to pull my leggings up, but they are flattering. They're a nice length, like there's no camel toe. They fit very, very nicely. Um, of course, like here we can see, and here, uh, they're not too tight, like I can move freely in them. They're just not a pair of leggings that I probably would run for usually. Um, but yeah, I, I like the color and I also do like like the logo there and they do kind of come down into the bum, which I think is quite flattering as well. Can we just, like Gymshark have honestly stepped up their game with this launch. Every launch that I've worked with them so far, each time it's just like stepping up, the game is being upped every single time. Anyway, back we go. These, love them. They're really, really, really nice and very, very stretchy and I just love the colour. And that is it from the Legacy Collection. Now, I didn't actually get anything else from Legacy, the Legacy Collection. The Legacy Logo Tight Shorts, for me, they are very short and I just won't wear them. And I know I won't because they're very, very, very short. I am a cycling short girl. Like if you watch all of my hauls, I prefer cycling shorts 110%. Just because being taller, I, I find that I've got more material that I can move them around. Yes, I may make them shorter, but I've got more material to move them around. So I love how they've got the drawstring on the side and you can obviously suit them to yourself. But I just, it's just not enough material for myself. In terms of the others as well, um, there's kind of crop tops launching. I love the Legacy mid Midi tanks. Gus, I didn't get one of those because they look amazing. I've seen them on a couple of people and they look so nice. So I love um, them. We then actually move on to the Adapt pattern. I'm here for this. Honestly, guys, I am so here for this collection. You have no idea. Let's firstly start with the bra. Okay, this is coming in three colors. We've got the black, forest green, and the woodland brown. I have all of them in the green, okay? Um, now, as we know, I'm always honest with you guys, okay? The sports bra, um, I actually wore this yesterday. I was doing, what did I do? I did a failed attempt at legs. I gave up halfway through, aside from the point. I then did some cardio. This bra for me is not a bra I would pick, okay? Um, you guys, you guys know, I'm always honest with you, it's too big um, in the sense of it's too much coverage. I really do like a small bra, okay? I've said it multiple times, I know I have. Straps, as we can see, is very, very big. The front, I actually really like. If we got ignored the straps, again, these were thin. The front, obviously, being nice and scrunched, I really like that, and I love the colour. The colour is stunning. I, I love green, and me, I'll go, like, I love green, okay? It's one of my favourite colours. Um, if we look here, it just, I love the pattern of it as well. Like, that is really pretty, and I love, obviously, the kind of scrunch at the front. I think it really finishes off nicely. It's just the back, and it's so much coverage. Now, some people may think you're, you're being silly, that's not a lot of coverage. I feel like that's a lot of coverage. I feel like it's quite blocky on me, and it just doesn't make me feel that kind of confidence. It has got removable pads in it. Um, I do wear a small, I probably could size down, to be honest with you. It feels quite stretchy as well. So no adjustable straps, but I do, can find can fall down a little bit, which doesn't really bother me. Personally, it's not my go-to. However, we have a strong contender, okay? Let's go with the leggings first. I prefer the leggings over the shorts. I know, shocked. I'm shocked myself as well. I thought I'd prefer the shorts. The scrunch bum. The scrunch bum. I'm here for it. I, I'm not usually a scrunch bum person, but if it hasn't got the contouring underneath the bum, I like a scrunch bum. That's what I've decided. So here is the scrunch bum here. Um, again, it's, it, it, they're not tight. Like they're not a, um, what am I thinking of? A stiff stiff they're not a stiff material they, they are quite stretchy but they actually when you've got them on they just hold that i personally find in terms of the logo it's just at the front nice and small um of course very very stretchy guys then they're, they're not too restrictive at all as well which is why i like them and um, we can see here like that's obviously quite nice in terms of the ankle it's not too um restrictive either the color i'm sorry this color is like i said i love it i literally love it you can see there we go you can see all the pattern on the color there now which is quite cool I, I think it's really nice it's not something i've seen before with that that color i feel like this the my lighting on my camera doesn't do a true representation looks it makes him look more till i can promise you guys it's very very green like it's actually quite a bright green um dark dark and bright green does that make any like a vibrant dark green there we go that's what i'm thinking of a vibrant dark green to be precise but yeah um i really really like them with the actual bum scrunch i do prefer another pouch i'm going to show you in a second it's not my absolute favorite this whole set here is not my favorite okay um but i like them like the bra not 100 leggings i prefer them much more then we have the shorts I don't think anything can beat my animal seamless with the, the animal shorts that I have from um, 
from Gymshark. I just love, I love the, the those ones and like the camo as well. These are much better in terms of length as well. So these are actually the cycling shorts, which honestly I prefer so much. I just, I just can't do the shorts. I did them on the la last launch and they're just, for me, they're very revealing. And I, I don't mind obviously like short shorts. I love short shorts, but they're a bit too short short, <laughs> especially when doing legs as well. Um, so again, obviously these have the bum scrunch. Like I said, I wore these yesterday and they're very kind of comfy. They're not too tight either, which I enjoy. I do personally roll them down. I just find it's quite a thick, um, quite a big waistband. So I just roll them down, obviously a little bit neater than that to be fair um but yeah that's that's my kind of thought on them i like them i do like them i like them a lot and i like obviously the bum scrunch as well they sit nicely underneath the bum and yeah i would recommend staying true to size they are stretchy and no they do not like uh what am i thinking of they do not cut like half carve is that the right wording into your quads which for me honestly i can't stand it if it's too tight i'm not going to wear it it's not a comfy fit <laughs> there we go okay next up for some reason I cannot find these leggings on my actual PDF. These are called the Adapt Camo Seamless Sports Wear, and you'll see the photo of me wearing the actual leggings on the screen now. <laughs> of me on the screen now wearing them. Guys, I love them. Honestly, I love them. I love them so much. I was so surprised that I loved them this much. Like I said, I haven't worn leggings in a long time. They, they stole my heart. They did steal my heart. Um, these actually have no scrunch bum. They have no scrunch bum whatsoever. Actually, I didn't mind it. I quite liked it. Um, very 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 comfy like guys very comfy they are so soft as well not like a lululemon soft but a soft like can you see that stretch i can mold them onto my bum how i like to mold them like how i like to mold leggings into my bum like it fits nicely it fits comfy it's not restrictive it's what i like to see like look here i'm sorry that's just it's heaven it's absolute heaven on the actual ankles as well absolutely fine color wise now this color is the black camo brown here I didn't think I'd like the color either, but guys, I love it. Like, I literally love it. I wore them with the with black Metcons, um, and I just I just felt so comfy in them. So these are actually at the top of my list for for this whole launch. I would say these are top five, a hundred and ten percent top five. I wear a medium, um, and they fit very very comfy. They I do not need to size down. I do not need to size up. In terms of the band, um, I can sometimes roll it down a little bit. It depends how I feel, to be honest with you. Um. But yeah, I love these. We then have the bra. Now I've actually shown this bra before in a different, when I was doing the Gymshark sale, that's right. Um, and it's actually coming back with this here. So I love the front. And honestly guys, for someone that has literally non-existent boobs, this makes me feel like I have a little bit of cleavage in my life. It makes me happy in that sense. <laughs> um, but when I'm wearing something like this, I would have to wear shorts. I, I just feel like if I've got my leggings, I just feel very, I don't know, if I'm wearing that and, and this as well because it's got quite thick straps it's just not my usual go-to so what i do is i'd wear this with like shorts um so this obviously has non-adjustable straps as well as we can see you can really see the color there and you've of course got the adjustable um not adjustable straps it's got the removable pads that's what i'm thinking of it's got the removable pads um there and then at the front you have this really nice detailing this is not adjustable okay this doesn't adjust at all like it just doesn't change um you can see obviously it does stretch um when you obviously wear them like there you can see it stretches they have have obviously got the pads in and it's just a nice plain simple bra but with quite a nice little bit of detailing at the front i think that's really pretty like i really really like it it's just the straps are a tiny bit too thick but i will wear this one 100 because i really like the front of it so yeah this stay true to size it's stretchy it's comfy and you don't need to size up or size down next up we have my absolute favorite of this entire launch um coming I personally think this will be the best selling piece for the for the women's collection because the amount of messages I've had saying, oh my God, that bra, I need the bra. It's it's lush, guys. It's honestly lush. Lush. I can't get my words out. So, and um, this is the Elevate Twist Front Bralette and it's light support. Let me tell you guys, it's lighter than light. Like the support is light. Very, very, very light. Like extra light. You get the gist. It's non-existent, okay? When I tell you, um, it's the most smallest bra you will probably see. It really is. Um, and I have actually worn this. I've got this in two colours. So I have this in the black and the fog green. And I have worn it in the black, which you'll have actually just seen the photo earlier on. Um, there we have it. Can we see what I mean? Like, it's just, it's non-existent, isn't it? I, I love it. I literally love it. There's no padding whatsoever. Like, literally nothing. Um, that's it. That's as thick as we're going to get. That is the material. Like, there's literally nothing here. It's buttery soft. I love it. It twists at the front as well, which I think is so cute. So, like that. Now, I have seen some individuals actually t twist it. So, when they're kind of wearing it, they have it cross over the front. Um, I personally find, even I have it just straight, that it's quite close to revealing something, potentially. Like, a little bit of a, a reveal. Um, 
when training. So that's one kind of thing to be careful of. If you do prefer more coverage, this is not the bra for you. If you want support, this is not the bra for you. Okay, this is very much a small, tiny bra that has no support whatsoever, okay? It makes the boobs look fantastic though, I will tell you that. It has obviously the Gymshark logo there, very, very kind of small as we can see. Like it's pretty much non-existent. Can you see that? Yeah, there we go. That's it, that's all you've got. That is the detailing of the entire bra. <laughs> There's nothing else on it. Um, it has obviously got the adjustable straps, which I love, I love the adjustable straps. I think it just obviously makes it fit better as well. Um, it's just so soft and I feel like it's just, it's a bit of me. This is me in a bra. This is definitely me in a bra. Um, and of course this color here, which like I said, I haven't yet worn it, but look at that. It just sits so nicely. It's just very close to revealing. So if you are somebody that actually um, prefers a bit more support, this is not the bra, okay? Size-wise, I don't need to size up. Like this is a good size to me. Um, I'm happy that size and it's a comfortable fit as well. I just love it. Like I literally love it. It's so soft. It's tiny. It's literally tiny. It reminds me of that bra they did um, and actually I wasn't working with them and I wore, I've wore, worn this bra quite a lot and I actually bought it in a couple of different colours as well. It comes up here and it did have the adjustable straps at the back but you can actually take the straps out and it's like a bralette um, that sits around your neck. That's the kind of vibe that it's going with in my personal opinion. We then move on and this item, love it. Literally, love it guys. Um, and I know some of you are going to think, why have you got that in this time of year? Well, I'm sorry, I'm preparing myself. I am preparing myself because in the UK, and as we can tell, yes, I've been trying this on because it's undone. In the UK, the summer has been non-existent. So I was getting myself prepared for a couple of weeks time when the jumpers are coming back out. I'm sorry, not that I'm excited because I do like summer, but this is the most comfiest thing ever. It's literally like a teddy bear. Can we just, can we just appreciate this jacket. I just thought what a cute way to finish off an outfit. Even as like just generally going to like the shops or something, going shopping and I was having like an all black outfit. I thought oh, I need a little bit of a fleece. This is it, this is it. And it's fully obviously um, comes down. Do -do. Bear with, boom. And we have it opens up nicely. It's not too heavy, it's not too thick either. Like it's quite a nice thickness. I wear this in a, medium um i always size up in jump in the jumpers in the jackets because then if i wear a jumper underneath it's quite a nice fit i just love this you've got the very very small logo there on the actual chest and that is literally it like it's then plain simple it's black it's plain and simple it'll go with so many different things and it's so cozy this is by far one of my top picks this the smaller bras with the twist and then also the camo um camo leggings they're my top they're my top items they are my top items i would tell you guys that <laughs> Hold up, I've just found some more items. So, I have a couple more, um, a couple more leggings from the Elevate collection. Now they do say on this international exclusive, um, so just bear that in mind if you are, just in case, it may not be on your website, um, I cannot 100% guarantee. So with uh, this, these are actually the Elevate leggings, so I haven't yet tried them on. Again, this is like Lululemon vibes, um, they're so soft, like so soft, I'm pleasantly surprised. Now, there is no front seam, which is good. I'm very happy about that. Obviously, you have got the Gymshark logo down the top left. You've then got, obviously, the seam down the bum there. They're plain, they're simple. Again, they are so stretchy and they're so soft. In terms of these leggings, these are not my kind of usual go-to, like I said to you guys earlier. I do prefer the other material, um, just because I find that the fit of these can slightly roll down. And I actually also have this color. This color I'm not a huge fan of, um, I can't lie to you. This for me, I did think it would be a little bit more brown. Um, so this is actually the washed mauve, um, however we say that. Okay, fine, the leggings are not a bit, like the color is not a bit of me. And personally, I do find they slip down a little bit. It's not the color I thought it would be, to be fair. Um, I just don't think with my hair color, I just I just feel like I'm going to look a bit naked, which is just not a bit of my color usually. I thought it was more brown. I'm very much like, I love brown. Um, so I'm a little bit shocked to this color, not shocked, but a little bit like, mm, I probably wouldn't reach for this color. Um, but I love, obviously the actual material is really kind of soft, like very soft. If you love this type of material, these are definitely the leggings for you. They're personally for me, not my absolute, I'd run for them, like I'd sprint for them. I personally wouldn't sprint for them. <laughs> so that actually is the Elevate collection done. We then move on to the last part of the leggings that I have. And I think I might have saved the best for last. I'm not sure. Um, and I've actually fully filled my top five. But anyway, these are the Rest Day Rouge Leggings. These are brand new. I actually posted them on my story. There we go. And I've actually posted them on my photo dump as well. You guys were like, where are these leggings from? Well, they're Gymshark. Now, the reason I love these is because I am sorry. Firstly, boom, the bum, okay? This honestly is slow flattering. And then, boom, we have the front. Now this pleasantly surprised me, okay? The front, 
I'm not screaming about, like not my absolute favorite, but I actually quite like the different design because otherwise I always have the same thing. So it's quite nice to actually change it up a little bit. The only thing I didn't like, and this is the only thing, is actually kind of how low this goes. Like, I feel like this goes quite down quite low. I feel like if it was a bit more straight, then I'd prefer it a little bit more. But if you look there, can you see how that seam obviously goes a little bit low? There's no front, front seam at the front. Um, obviously, so there's no, gonna be no camel toe, which is good. The actual seam there, like, they, they fit like a glove, guys. I was pleasantly surprised. And the bum is so flattering, it shocked me. Like, again, this is not a legging, like a, a pair of leggings that I would usually pick, but I was like, you know what? Push myself out of the comfort zone. Let's do it for the haul. And here we are, pleasantly surprised. Pleasantly surprised. Again, I would stay true to size. Like, I don't need to size down, I don't need to size up. They fit comfortably. You've got the small Gymshark logo there. Everything else is very, very plain. They are very stretchy, very, very stretchy. Um, I believe, in terms of here as well, they are stretchy as well. Like. They fit like a glove. I love them. I was so surprised by these guys. It's just the front is tiny bit lower than I wanted it to be, but I still I still like them. Like I really, really do like them. They're in my top five, guys. They are in my top five. And then the bum. That's, that's, that's flattering. Um, so I wear a small in these and I love the colour as well. Like, can we see? I've gone for so many greens <laughs> in this launch. That's what I was like, right, stop with the greens now, G. You've gone for too many greens. Okay, last but not least, we have the GFX collection. Guys, this is an oversized fit with graphic prints. Love. I feel like this is the best way for me to end this haul, to be honest with you. I have the oversized sweatshirt, and Harv and I are going to be 110% arguing over who wears this. I wore it yesterday, and just, it, it's so cool. Like, I love it. I'm usually quite a person that quite likes simple on my jumpers, um, but can we just... I'm sorry, what? I felt so cool wearing this. <laughs> Can we just appreciate that? Like, that is sick. Um, so we've got the Gymshark, and then of course, what does it say? Um, it says lifting apparel, and then of course, you have established in 2012. That is just sick. That is obviously the back of the jumper. And then on the front, you literally have the little Gymshark there, um, which of course, as well. I have a medium in this, and as you can see in the video, it's quite a baggy fit. I wanted baggy, and I knew that half and I would probably wear it to like steal it from each other. Um, and I just love it i have obviously rolled up the the sleeves as well just personally how i kind of prefer wearing my jumpers but this i just love like i'm sorry that back is so cool Harv was like why did you not get me one of those jumpers as well but i was like honestly love like love that is top five i think i've given you about six for my top five but every single one of them has been amazing like can we see what i mean by each haul it's getting better and better and better and better so firstly we have the adapt camo um i just love the, the leggings of those then we also have the elevate twist front bra that i absolutely love then of course we have this jumper then we also have the rouge leggings and then if i had to pick one more item i would probably say the legacy t bra um t bar sorry sports bra this is quite small minimalistic that's my top items like love absolutely love boom there we have it that is everything so if you have any questions at all please pop them down below and then more than happy to answer any questions as best i possibly can as always if you use my um my discount code glj thank you so much of course it saves you guys 10 percent. yes it does give me a little bit of commission i am of course in partnership with gymshark as you guys know i'm always honest with you um like i always say if i like an item if i don't like an item and yeah that's pretty much everything for me please don't hit the like button subscribe down below more hauls are coming i promise i try and make sure i do them every single time they launch items i feel like it helps you guys i love filming them as well um which is brilliant so Otherwise, I will catch you guys in the next video and thank you so much for watching.